My name is Alex Wondergem. I'm a student at the University of the Arts London and the founder of Club Clover. It started out in the summer of 2012. I wanted my trousers in a particular style and I couldn't find them anywhere, so I decided to work with a tailor and got them made. Uh, it was a pretty personal project at the time, but later on, people seemed to really, really like them, so uh, I saw the potential to create something new and exciting. Uh, so six months later, we launched our online store, posting our wax block print trousers. And from there, we decided to branch out and make something new. So we came out of a line of caps, which eventually brought us a lot of attention and demand. And yeah, that was the beginning of the club buzz. What makes Clove unique is the fusion of Guinean culture and urban wear. We try to make our stuff have an international and modern appeal. Ghana has been my home for the past 15 years, as well as my source of inspiration. My mother is Guinean and I've been raised with certain values which have brought me where I am today. Being independent allows us to have complete creative freedom. We have control over our image and uh, therefore we can materialize ideas into products with a lot of flexibility. Uh, thanks to Clove's online presence, we've managed to appeal to an international community with the aid of social media. It's allowed us to communicate with a variety of people, and this has brought us success around the globe from Los Angeles, Paris, Berlin, and Athens, to name a few. I really enjoy working with my team. I have my brother Yannick and my friend Willy, who's practically my brother, I've known him forever. Working together is fun because we've known each other for so long. I mean, I have my two best friends and every day is more or less a crazy adventure, so what more could I ask for? This year has been pretty awesome. I'm just taking things one step at a time and it's been an actual summer for once, you know? <laughs> The sun's out, I mean, the weather's really cool, it's perfect. It's literally how I describe a close summer. So yeah, I can't wait to head over to GH. I'm just finishing things up with the rest of the team. We've got a bunch of photo shoots and other stuff in the works. Is this as usual here in London for the next couple weeks? You know, shipping out parcels and getting out the products. Until I head to Ghana, I guess it's business as usual.